What's up guys? Today we are gonna show you some details about the G-Skill Aegis DDR4M. We will do some tests and some overclocking too. Let's get started. The first step is always to check out the manufacturer website for the basic information. Here we can find an overview, some main specs and the QVL, which is the qualified motherboard list. The list is not comprehensive. If your motherboard is not listed here, you can check the motherboard manufacturer website regarding RAM compatibility or contact G-Skill Tech Support. Here you can see our system configuration. Here are some more details from the Typhoon Burner app. Let's see some test results. Let's try some basic overclocking. The 3200 MHz was already too much. The computer didn't boot. The truth, to be told, we didn't dive too deeply into the different BIOS values. Overall, this RAM has a reasonable price tag and does his job quite well. Thanks for watching and please share your thoughts in the comment section below.